Hey everybody, welcome back to part two of my Funko Pop collection. Today I'm going to show you the other half of the first pops I didn't show you in the other video. Um, I got them right here on the side. I took them all off from the shelf behind me as well too. So let's get started. Let's get started right now. First three pops I want to show you guys. We have from Dark Crystal the movie. 340, 341, and 342. Now I said this before with the other pop that I do have. Um, I, I'm a big fan of uh, Jim Henson's Dark Crystal and of course Labyrinth. And I love the movie. That's why I got these pops. I do love the artwork. I do love the whole uh, picture and the artwork on the pops. I do love the detail that they do put into these uh, characters now. Um, some pops are just kind of plain, some kind of boring, but I do like how they get all the detail. I mean, they got everything on his robe, his sword and everything, and all their accessories, all their characters, you know, their outfits. Are, are, I think they're just pretty nice looking. I think they're pretty cool. Uh, I do like the whole detail of it. Next two pops, I got these two at FYE. We have both Ed and Sean from, of course, Sean the Dead, the movie. I love the movie. I've seen it before. I actually own the movie on Blu-ray, and these are actually the two that I picked up. Um, I was saying, again, how they put a lot of detail into these pops. If you can see closely on Sean, he's got a little bit of red on him. <laughs> yeah, he has uh, some of the, you know, the blood splatter and, of course, a little bit of red ink from his pen. You know, I was I was thinking maybe they could probably make like a, a hot fuzz, you know, hot fuzz characters of these guys. You know, just put them in police uniforms. It, it would look maybe the same, not really, but uh, I think that'd be pretty neat. You know, put them in police uniforms from Hot Fuzz. I don't think they need any more of these uh, characters made besides these two. I, 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 that's just my opinion. You know, that's just my opinion. Next two pops I want to show you guys. I got from uh, Hot Topic. Not Hot Topic, but Hot Topic and GameStop. We have both uh, Tyrese from Walking Dead and, of course, a Burning Walker from, of course, Walking Dead. Now, of course, you can get Tyrese just about anywhere at any Hot Topic. He's, you know, everywhere. He's actually at a reduced price. He doesn't really go for much. He sells for really cheap. And the Burning Walker, of course, you can only get it when the uh, summer conventions came out. Of course, I got this at GameStop. There was a lot of these guys left inside the store. Not many of them were bought. So, hey, I don't have it. And, of course, I love Walking Dead, so that's why I got it. Now, like I said, I do like Walking Dead. I have a couple of the seasons on uh, DVD already. I need to get some more characters. I do really want to get some more characters in from the show. But, uh, you know, hopefully I can. But, uh, you know, there is that episode which happened. I'm not going to explain it, but if you know what I mean, if you've seen it, you know what I'm talking about. I'm not going to explain the episode, but I, I still love the show. I still like it. I watch it. Next pop I'm going to show you is just by itself. We have uh, Billy from Saw. Billy the Puppet. I got this guy at FYE, you know, just kind of separately. Um, I did show him in my haul video before, and I have seen all the Saw movies. You know, it. I'm not really into Saw, but you know, I, I do watch it every time. You know, when Halloween comes around, when I'm, this the month of October, you know, I, I do watch it. I do watch it. I think the character, I like the little doll, is actually pretty, you know, pretty cool looking to me. Next two pops I'm going to show you guys. I got this one at uh, Walgreens, and I got this one at Barnes and Noble. We have Snoopy and, of course, Charlie Brown. Uh, Snoopy actually came out with the uh, other convention pops. You know, I did get him as well, along with my Newt Scamander pop and my Game of Thrones pop. And Charlie Brown, I just got him on a random hunt, you know. You know, I, I do watch the uh, Charlie Brown specials that they have. You know, of course, the uh, Great Pumpkin, of course, Thanksgiving and Xmas, whatever comes out. You know, I, I think it looks I think it looks all right. You know, I, I do really want the, uh, the other Snoopy. I do want that one. Next two pops I'm going to show you. I got these at Target. We have both Nathan Drake. And of course we got a Super Brains from uh, Plants vs. Zombies. Now I have played the game Uncharted. You know, I do like the character. I do like the whole story. with Uncharted as well too. Um, Plants vs. Zombies, I haven't really played it. Honestly, I don't really plan to. You know, the reason why I got this, you know, I, I, do, like, I do like the color scheme. I do like the whole design. I just mostly like it for the color on the box and everything as well too. And you can get these guys just about at every single target. They're pretty common. You know, pretty easy to find. They're not the really the most sought out pops to get. But, you know, I got them when they got released. You know, that's why I got them. Next two pops I'm going to show you. I got these also at Target. We have from uh, Borderlands the game. We have uh, Mad Moxie and of course we got Psycho. Now these two pops, you can get them just about anywhere. They're very common, not really sought out for, not the really most I must have, must get. 
But uh, yeah, these are pretty common. You know, I do like playing Borderlands. You know, that's why I got these two pops right here. This is an incomplete set. I still need the other two to get. It's kind of sad. I don't really have a lot of complete sets here. But, uh, you know, I'm trying. I'm trying to. But yeah, I like Borderlands. That's why I got these two. I like a lot of stuff, by the way. <laughs> Uh, these pops, I'm actually going to show you all together. I'm going to show you all four of these pops. We have uh, from Fallout. I love Fallout, the game. I play it constantly. We have number 50. And of course, we got 51. And of course, we got 52. And this one, I actually did not buy it together. I actually uh, got it differently out of a mystery box. We have, <clears throat> excuse me, uh, number 98. Now, these are actually pretty common. Yeah, I have them. But, uh, you know, I like Fallout, I like playing the game, you know, I got the, uh, the Ghoul, and of course I got Super Mutant, and of course I have Deathclaw, and of course Charisma Pop. I was hoping actually to get the, um, other ones. You know, Charisma's actually pretty neat, you know, it's pretty cool looking, you know, but I, I really wish I got a Toughness or Medic or the, uh, Skeleton one. I really wish I did. Um, I, I'll tell you a little bit more about this one in a minute. But these three, I got a little FYE, pretty common, get them just about anywhere. You know, I, I got these as soon as I started collecting pops. Of course, FYE had a sale. You know, you buy two, get one for like half off or whatever. That's why I got these three. And this one right here, um, this actually comes in the uh, mystery box pop. If you, you know, got one, if you bought them, you had a chance of getting, you know, one of those four. Of course, you know which one I got already. I was hoping to get the adamantium skeleton. That's that's the, uh, that's, that's the really one. That's the one that I wanted. But I don't really buy a lot of the mystery box pops. Uh, can't even speak, <laughs> sorry. But I, I don't really buy a lot of these uh, mystery boxes because I keep getting the same. I bought this. I bought the ones with the Deadpool. I kept getting Stingray, 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 and then I just had like a bunch of comments, so I didn't really want a whole bunch. So I'm just stick to only buying just one. Just buying just one of the mystery boxes from now on because I hate getting comments. Next pop, I'm going to show you by itself. We have from uh, Fallout 4, of course, the Fallout series. We have, of course, uh, dog meat, but not just any dog meat. The one from uh, GameStop. He's a flocked exclusive. Um, I actually did not buy this. No, I didn't steal it. <laughs> but I actually uh, won it in a uh, giveaway contest on Instagram. I did a whole video about it, about me unboxing this thing. I thought it was actually pretty cool for me to actually uh, win something like this, um, especially a pop. Like I said, I'm a big fan of uh, Funko Pops. I love Fallout as well, too. So I think this is actually pretty cool. Um, they actually gave me a pop box protector. I think that was pretty neat. I think that was pretty cool of them. Okay. Now, moving on, we have from uh, the Doom series. They have three Doom Marine soldiers, all in different colors. And there's, uh, I think, still two more, maybe three more out there. I don't know. Yeah, I'm not really a big expert on it. But uh, I think this one is bronze. It looks like bronze to me. I, I, th I think it is. I don't know. I'm not a big expert on the color. And then we have, of course, white. And, of course, the last one, which is, uh, yeah, it's red. I thought these looked really cool. I actually, honestly, I have not played Doom, but uh, I think the uh, little uh, soldiers look actually pretty cool, pretty neat. I like their outfits and everything. Um, I haven't played it. If you played it, let me know. Just make a comment down below. But, yeah, I got them. Like, pretty cool. Okay. Now, we're all done with that. I'm actually going to move on to my Star Wars pops. I'm going on to Star Wars next. We have these two. You all know who he is. Yoda. Of course, this is uh, Dagobah Yoda. And, of course, just uh, regular Yoda. It says it right there. But, yeah. If you all have seen Star Wars, you know where the name comes. Dagobah Yoda. Uh, one thing about the Star Wars pops, I love how they put uh, these little bases on the uh, pops. I think they look actually really cool. Um, that's one thing Star Wars, I think... Um, I think it's pretty cool, these little black bases. I like those, I like those especially on all Star Wars pops. Big fan of Star Wars, by the way. Big fan of Star Wars. Uh, next one I do want to show you guys. We have uh, Poe Dameron. We have uh, Princess Leia. And, of course, we have, uh, who was that? Oh, yeah, Han Solo. Han Solo from, of course, uh, the movie Force Awakens. I love Force Awakens. I saw it in the theaters with my cousins and everything. We even waited in the line for it. The day before, it's release day. Um, there's a lot of Star Wars pops to collect. There's a lot of Star Wars pops. I'm going to turn the boxes around real quick. You see how many Star Wars pops you need to get? Just to complete the set. There's a lot of them out there. A lot of exclusives, a lot of different variants of these guys. Um, I am planning on seeing Rogue One. I am planning on seeing it when it gets released, most definitely. Can't wait for that. It comes out like, what, next week? Next week? That's crazy. 
I can't believe it. I'm going to be in line to see it. It's going to be insane. Next pop I want to show you guys. I actually got these from Walgreens. I'm showing them right now. And we got Ray. Now, I was actually pretty excited when they released the uh, Ray Pop. I was actually, uh, you know, trying to find him. Couldn't find him anywhere, but now I got him. Um, I'm actually, uh, I actually like the act, the actress Daisy Ridley. Really. I think she did a great job as Ray. Can't wait to see her in the other Star Wars films when they come out. Episode, uh, <clears throat> I don't know the name of the episode, but um, you know, Force Awakens, and she's gonna be in the next. one. I don't know what they're naming it, but you know, when it comes, when it comes, then then you know, I'll be pretty excited to find out. But yeah, these two guys, I'm not a big expert on Plo Koon or Riyis, but, you know, I think they're pretty neat looking. You know, trying to get most of the exclusives, which I'm, you know, aiming for. Next two, I got these two right here. We have uh, Captain Phasma and, of course, BB-8. Yeah, I'm actually a, uh, I actually like BB-8. I like the little uh, android in the movie. <laughs> um, I wanted to get the other one from the uh, exclusive with the uh, thumbs up. I wanted to get that one. I wanted to get that BB-8 when he's uh, sticking out his lighter. I think it's a lighter. I'm not sure what it is. I'm, like, I'm not a big expert on BB-8, but I think it was actually really cool that he was in the movie. And Captain Phasma. I didn't really see much of Captain Phasma in the movie. Um, the outfit looks pretty neat looking. I'm not a big expert <clears throat> on Captain Phasma or anything, but, uh, you know, it's, 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 it's cool. The outfit looks cool. I like it. There's that chrome metallic one, I believe. I want that one. I want that one, too. Next pop I'm going to show you guys. I was going to include this, but uh, I couldn't find it in the pile. But uh, we have uh, another Walgreens exclusive, um, an AT driver. I think this one actually looks pretty neat looking. Um, it's kind of plain, it's kind of simple, kind of random, kind of common. You can find it just about in almost any Walgreens. Most of the Walgreens actually have a lot of these Star Wars pops in there, a lot of the Star Wars Force Awakens pops inside their uh, store. And yeah, you can get them just about anywhere, everywhere, at every Walgreens. I got those new ones that came out, the Rebels. Um, I bought one of those. I bought it for a friend. Um, yeah, I should have bought one for myself, but I bought it for the friend first. Next two pops I'm going to show you guys. We have, of course, also from Star Wars. We have one of the Troopers. And, of course, we have uh, Kylo Ren. Um, I was actually trying to complete the whole set of uh, Force Awakens. It's still incomplete, unfortunately. Hopefully I can complete the set soon. But, yeah. Kylo Ren and Flame Trooper. That's what I have. Next two pops I'm going to show you guys. If I can get them. We have another Trooper. And of course we have... I'm going to butcher that name. Nia Nub? Hey, I hope so. I don't know if I pronounced that right. But yeah, this is actually a uh, Walgreens exclusive Snow Trooper. Um, it's actually pretty common. Find them just about anywhere. As well as this guy right here. There's a GameStop exclusive of him. But yeah, these are actually pretty common. Get in just about anywhere. But these are the other two pops that I got in my collection. Next two pops I'm going to show you guys. They're the same. We have from Star Wars. Of course, we got Luke Skywalker. We have Ceremony Luke Skywalker. And of course, what is this? Uh, the Encounter. Best, best Bit Encounter. If y'all seen Star Wars, of course, the original trilogy, you know how... He got his hand chopped off. He cut his hand off. I'm not gonna explain it any more further, but yeah, it's it's pretty it's pretty well known how he got his hand chopped off. And of course, ceremony, Luke Skywalker. I actually got this one. I like this one right here. And this one, yeah, I, I like I like the blue sticker. I, I like I like these two ones right here. Yeah, I, I like these both. It's still an incomplete set. I still need the blue Senate. Of course, you can only get blue Senate through to, uh, other means. You can probably get them on a website. You can't really find them in stores, unfortunately. But yeah, Luke Skywalker. You know, there's still a couple more Luke Skywalkers out there. I think it's about, what, three more to get, maybe? Four more, maybe? There's a lot of these Star Wars. A lot of Star Wars pops out there. A lot of them. Next, I'm going to show you guys. We have uh, Han Solo again. And, of course, we have uh, Chewbacca. But not just any Han Solo. This is the uh, Loot Crate exclusive. Check that out. And, of course, Chewbacca. There's a couple more of the Chewbacca's out there, more Chewies out there. There's one where he's, uh, I believe, flocked, I believe it is, yeah. And there's another one, it's an older one, I believe he has snow covered on him. There's that one, I think those ones actually look pretty cool. Uh, but yeah, I'm really I'm really glad I got this uh, one. I don't really have any Loot Crate exclusive. This is actually, you know, pretty nice, pretty, you know, pretty cool looking. Chewbacca, who doesn't like him? I like him. 
Uh, next pop. Oh yeah, wait, wait a minute. There's another exclusive that I have. But it's not from Loot Crate. It's the uh, Smuggler's Bounty one. Uh, we had Red Snaggle. Uh, what is that? Red Snaggle Tooth. Yeah, that's who it is. Um, if y'all seen the movies, you know where he comes from. You know which uh, you know movie he comes from. Uh, I think the one actually looks pretty cool as well too. I don't really have any uh, Smuggler Bounty exclusives as well too. Um, I actually picked this one up uh, through uh, Zia Records. I picked him up in the store. I was like, wait a minute. That looks different. So, you know, I went to go pick him up. Now I got him. Last two Star Wars pops I'm going to show you guys. We have Finn. And, of course, we have another Ray. Now, I like both these actors. I like, uh, you know, I, 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 like, I like their performance in the movies. I can't wait to see them in other stuff as well, too. And, of course, you hear me talk about Ray, of course. Now I got her through GameStop. This is when she's holding her little doll. And, of course, we have Finn. I like both I like both actors. I can't wait to see them in other films. Hopefully, you know, hopefully Star Wars Rogue One will be actually pretty cool. Can't wait to see it. I'm going to be waiting in line early. Hopefully, it'll be, you know, just, uh, I hope my experience will be just as great as when I saw The Force Awakens in theaters. That's going to be really exciting and really fun, folks. Hope you all bought your tickets. That's the last of my Star Wars pops. I don't even know where to set them. <laughs> That's the last of my Star Wars pops. I'm going to end this on uh, part two right here. If y'all like part two, please comment, like, and subscribe. And I'll definitely see you guys next time for part three. That's when I tackle the Marvel pops. And then on part four, I'll get the DC pops. But yeah, comment, like, and subscribe. And I'll see you next time on part three. Bye, guys.